I mean, I love this. Something like this, which is pure Jackie Onassis. I haven't got my glasses on, would you believe? So I can't actually see what designer that is. <laughs> me through the um, running order. We're on the way to Epsom. My hair's filthy and it's this is fake at the top. Thank you to Scott Cornwall who sent in this hair scrunchie that I'm wearing. It's rescued the day. And the most exciting part of this whole day, this is so close, this lens, I'm going to regret it if I do it like that. That's better. The most exciting part of the whole day, Lisa, is we've been given a car. Yes, and a Mercedes. It's a, it is a Mercedes. <laughs> Actually, how could I not know that with a lovely coffee rest? And um, actually, weather-wise, it's looking good. It's Look looking good. Out. This is an unsponsored video, but both Elisa and I are wearing Samantha Sun dresses. <laughs> Discounted price. <laughs> 75% yes. off. So Samantha, if you are tuning in, you know, it'd be good to replenish our stock, basically. <laughs> so tell me what else is happening. So we'll be speaking to Alex Willby from Hello, she's the commissioning editor. So she's part of the Judge Awards with Vogue Williams, who we'll also be speaking to. <gasps> who who's now engaged to uh, Spencer. And who's now pregnant. And is now pregnant. So yeah, and she's a friend of the show. She'll look amazing. She will. Yeah, so that's it. And hopefully some Made in Chelsea people. Love a bit of uh, MIC. <laughs> Love a bit of reality. I wish my grey wasn't showing. And I'm looking up. Better lighting, I think, here. Right, not long now. Yeah. They seek him there. His clothes are loud. But never square. It will make or break him, so he's got to buy the best because he's a dedicated follower. Capri? Yes. What have you got in there? I have something that you might need today, Joe. Oh, bring it out in the sunshine. Hi, Pete. Hi, Joe. This is amazing. This is the wonderful Tim from BBC Sussex in Surrey. Oh, Elisa. Yeah, you look good. It's Elisa. And this is Capri. Hello. We go back ages. He's never aged. <laughs> Yeah. Let's have a look. You ready? <gasps> oh, Mark, go on then. Which one are you having? I'm going to get the top hat. Yeah, I thought you would. But that will make me look taller. Go on, Capri. Let me have them. That one's for you. Yeah, that I one. like that. The little one. Oh, I love this. Oh, actually, that's really that's, love it. That was actually worn by someone at Reg, uh, Meghan and Harry's wedding. <gasps> this one. So you've got to find out who it was. It was worn at the royal wedding. Oh, oh my God. God. And she wore a blue dress similar to yours. <gasps> Pippa Middleton? Was it Pippa Middleton? Maybe. <gasps> oh my god, I think she it was. A, she had a weird old dress. Yes. <laughs> a weird old dress. <laughs> okay, next shot you'll see us all in our hats. No, 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 it's fine to the left. No, 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 it's fine. Gabrit literally made her outfit overnight because she knew she was going to be wearing a hat with a pink. It's pink. And a lot of help coming on. So annoying that Turn she's around. so tall, isn't it? Look, Pete, she made that overnight. She made the outfit overnight. Wow, yeah. Yeah. amazing. Thank you. And it matches the colours of the... It goes with the hat. So clever, <laughs> isn't it? Um, can we go and have some breakfast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. OK, we're going to go over um, and have breakfast. Would you move around? Do you want me to go around with the belt and you just hold the mic? If you like. If you don't mind. No, no, no. I'll just think it'll be a bit... That'll be my umbilical. Is that all right? Pete is yeah. going to be my... <laughs> Thank you, Pete. You're back, yes, this is throughout life. He'll be doing this. Oh, thanks, Pete. Yeah. Right. They seek him here. They seek him there. His clothes are loud. But never square It will make or break him So he's got to buy the best Cause he's 
a dedicated follower of fashion. And when he does, so I'm in Notting Hill and this is probably one of the best places to get really good, sorry, thank you, really good clothes, fashionable clothes, second hand, because the store I'm going to take you to actually buys on your clothes as long as they're in good condition, gosh, sorry, the weather's going to change, and then they um, buy them from you, but you can also buy second hand clothes, designer clothes here for tokens. of London town. Pursuing all the latest fads and trends Cause he's a dedicated follower of fashion Oh yes he is Oh yes he is Oh yes he is Oh yes he is He thinks he is a flower to be looked at And when he pulls his frilly nylon And is right up tight he feels a Dedicated follower of fashion. So, this is where you can find a real bargain in Notting Hill, if you know what you're looking for. There is amazing designer stuff mixed with chain store stuff as well. So, if we just have a look at this. There are two floors. Downstairs is the more economical and uh, up here on the ground floor is more of the designer stuff and just have a look over here so you get the gist of it i mean it's i mean i love this something like this which is pure jackie anassis i haven't got my glasses on would you believe so i can't actually see what designer that is but these are the places you can pick up real bargains and i love that as well that's versace cardigan look at it beautiful little versace cardigan so it's really busy today. Yeah. Do you think when the um, sun comes out, everyone just wants to spend money, they're happier, or they're just looking for a complete new wardrobe? Yeah, or even when, like sometimes when it's, when it's raining outside, we, we find it hard to get into work because the pavement outside is so beyond blocked. Like Saturday is our busiest day, but like if it's sunny, then definitely more people come in. You girls really know what you're doing. I mean, because I've done this, I've bought stuff in, which I think is in really good nick. Yeah. And then you'll scrutinize it and you can see every single floor. I assume that's what you're yeah. trained to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're also trained to do things like fake checking, um, so stuff like that, really. And so what is, the, what is the, the merchandise that you're looking for? Is it mainly designer labels? It's mainly just, well, how we work is that um, if it's designer, you get 20%, but if it's not designer, you get 10%. But if, you, if it's not designer, it's also a lot less likely that we'll take it. It's like it's the thing. It's the thing that you will get paid the most for. It's the thing that we we can sell for like the highest price point. It's Chanel all day every day. And this really is like it's very modest outside. You had mm, no yeah. idea until someone it's actually told me what this place was. You drive by, you would never ever notice it, and yeah. then you come in, and it is like an Aladdin's cave. A lot of people that shop here keep it a secret because why would you tell everyone where you can get like designer clothes for like really cheap? No, no, no. Casan Alibaba. Yeah. What did you say? La caserne d'Alibaba. Yeah. <laughs> so tell everyone um, what days you're open. This is a bank holiday and you're really, really busy. We're open every single day, 10 to like. Every single day on a Sunday yeah. as well. Yeah. And what, since you've been here, what's the most exciting thing that item of clothing or maybe handbag or shoes, what's the most exciting thing that you've seen brought in? Um, we got a Messina top where like the bottom of the top is a flamenco skirt and the rest of the top has a flamenco woman on it. We bought in a red Burberry trench coat. Um, yeah, we have a Birkin at the minute. We've got bought a Birkin in. How fantastic. Do you buy any of the stuff yourselves or do you? Yeah. <laughs> well, there have to we be have some like perks. A, yeah, so. we have like a, a, a hold. You can hold stuff if you want. But like we still pay the same price as everybody else. Yeah. There's no discount for us. Yeah. But that's fine. Oh, well, listen, get out your way because you're so busy. There's a queue of people. Oh, Thank no, you. It's okay. Thank you. <laughs> no, I never thought they'd let me do that. And I never thought people would let me film them in there because you get some really um, well known people selling their stuff in there. So you don't know what sweat you're wearing and who it belongs to, basically, if you buy from there. Mind you, they're not very sweaty. It's all very clean. And uh... <laughs> hello. Beautiful day. So, have you had a nice walk? Everyone's in a good mood because it's sunny and I think everyone just feels so much better to be honest. So now, if I haven't got a parking ticket, 
my day will be complete. Uh -huh, let me see. And then do you know what I think I might do is go into the serpentine and have a swim. Because it's so hot. It's a really balmy night, balmy evening. There's my little mini. This is the moment, you see, whether if I haven't got a ticket, it was a worthwhile journey just to go in there and have a look. And I haven't. Hurrah!